Congratulations on your selection of CamFill air pollution control equipment. This series of videos will be your guide to the complete installation of the Gold Series X-Flow. Throughout these installation videos, references may be made to various components, which may or may not be part of your system. These components are included in the interest of fully describing typical systems with all available options. Again, thank you for choosing CamFill APC for your dust and fume collection needs. When your equipment arrives, reference your inspection sheet to make sure you received all the components to complete your order. A visual inspection of your equipment should be performed before it's removed from the truck. Dents, scratches, and other damage should be noted and photographed. The structural integrity of the housing will be adversely affected by large dents. The equipment should be closely inspected wherever cargo straps were used. Camfill APC should immediately be notified of any structural damage to your equipment. It is the purchaser's responsibility to file shortage reports and damage claims with the carrier and your Camfill APC representative. The carrier is responsible for any damage to the equipment while it's in transit, unless specific arrangements are made otherwise. The GSX collector is shipped disassembled and must be assembled by installation personnel. Unit assembly, apart from the electrical and air connections, can usually be accomplished by anyone with a basic understanding of common hand tools. Other than common hand tools, specialty tools needed to complete the installation include impact driver, hammer drill with masonry bit, and an alignment punch. Always use proper safety equipment and protocols while installing your dust collector. For any safety question, consult your on-site safety personnel. Camfill APC must rely on the skill, safety, and expertise of its customers and the customer's installation contractor to ensure that all electrical, water, and air connections are made correctly. Also, that all regulation devices are installed and operating properly.